What's going on? It's Big Guns and Pistols. I'm back with another one. Welcome. As I always say, if you new, subscribe to the channel. If you like the videos you've been seeing, press like on the videos because that does help with the channel. But y'all know me by now. I'm going to get straight into this. Now, I do want to let you all know that whenever I make a video, I don't write notes. I go straight off the top of my head and I give you guys the thoughts that I have. So the ATF says that it is now illegal to have a pistol brace. Now, I've made about two videos talking about this topic. I just have a few more thoughts that I want to convey. So the ATF says that it's illegal to now own a pistol brace of any kind. I've been thinking. The first thing I'm going to say is this. I would love to see the person the very person within the ATF who thought to do this. That's what I would like to see. I would love to see the very person within the ATF whose idea it was to make these pistol braces illegal. This is just a thought of mine because these are an organization of people who just says, you know what, we're gonna change this. No longer will these pistol braces be legal because this is the American people's way around having a short barrel rifle. I'm nearly certain that that's how they see it. This tells me a lot about how the government views things. Follow me. This tells me a lot about the arrogance of the ATF, but not just the ATF, the government, period. They sat here and totally bypassed Congress to do this because it's almost like they say, you know what? We have said in the past before that these braces were okay. We said that in the past. And when they said that, American gun owners went out, abided by the law, and they bought millions of pistol braces for their guns. They spent millions of dollars on pistol braces for their guns, thinking that they were abiding by the law, which they were, only for some time down the line for the ATF to come and say, you know what? Fuck that. We're going to make it illegal for any American gun owner or any American to have one of these. We're gonna change it. Think about the arrogance of the government for doubling back and saying, you know what, we're gonna change it now. F Never mind the fact that you all have went out there and purchased all of these firearms that came equipped with a pistol brace. Never mind that. We don't care. We want you to destroy it. Think about that. I want you to really think about that. They say, no, no, fuck that. Forget about that. Forget about us saying that, you know what, they're illegal. There's nothing wrong with having them. You can have it on anything that's uh, below 16 inches. Forget about that. Because people are putting these pistol braces on 10 and a half inches, 11 and a half inch firearms, 12 and a half inch firearms. And they just come and say, you know what? It's illegal now. Not only is it illegal, but destroy your property or turn it into us. I want that to sink in the conscience of those of you listening to the sound of my voice. They say, not only are we going to double back, change the law, make it illegal, Never mind the fact that you all have went out and purchased all of these firearms that came equipped with the with the arm brakes. Never mind that. It's now illegal. OK, not just that, but we want you to destroy it. We don't care how much money you spent on it. We're not going to compensate you. Destroy it or surrender it. I would wonder 
what is going on within the mind of the person or people who came together within the ATF and said, we're going to change it. We're going to make it illegal. You shouldn't even want to do such a thing as an American. You shouldn't even want to do such thing as an American. Because through these small thoughts like that comes bigger thoughts. And next thing you know, hey, it's going to be something else that they don't want the American gun owners to have. It all starts with the person who developed this idea, probably brought it to somebody else. Now they're having meetings about it. Now they're having sit downs about it. Now they're coming together. They say, you know what? Let's make it illegal now. Then all it takes is for a, somebody else to say, you know what? Those AK-47s, they don't need those. What the hell does an American need with an AK-47? They don't need those. So let's make, you know what? We, I think we need to make those illegal. See, this is how it starts. I'm just letting you all know what I think the things that I think, and just, you know, kind of the thoughts that I'm having. This is how it starts. Then next is something else. Then another thing. They're not going to want you or I to have body armor. I think there has already been some restrictions against that somewhere in America. I don't remember exactly where it was, but I think I remember hearing something about no body armor. Think of it. Nobody. I can't have. I, so I'm an American citizen. I'm not allowed to purchase body armor to protect myself for whatever reason. Think about these things, folks. The pistol brace, it starts here. Now, I will say this. Later on down the line, I do believe that this may get overturned. It might be a year down the line. It might be a year and a half, it might be two years, it might be two and a half years, three years, so on and so I do believe that this may be overturned, but then again, nothing that the government does surprises me. Nothing that this United States government does surprises me. I told you guys in my last videos, these people are tricky. They're manipulative. They like to redefine words and laws and shit so they can go along with their agenda. That's all I want to say. These are just the thoughts that I have. So if I'm off on anything, let me know. Sharpen me up in the comment section. You guys may bring a different point of view. You guys may say something that I didn't think of. And I say, hey, you know what? <laughs> I like that logic. You sharpen me up. I sharpen you up. That's how it's supposed to go. But that's all I pretty much want to say is big guns and pistols. If you like what I've been posting, be sure to subscribe to the channel. I got some new things that um, I'm going to be purchasing, but you all will see a little later down the line. Big guns and pistols. Peace.